You know, I'm really starting to realize the amount of shit that people are addicted to. Like, I actually think that the new addiction, and I'm actually guilty of this, is like social media and the internet and allowing it to, uh, it does something to your brain or whatever. Like, you know, it's fucking weird. Like, if I see a video and it's like nine minutes long, I'm like, I, I, don't, I don't have nine minutes. You know, but then I will sit there and watch like 4,000 fucking one minute clips for the next five hours or whatever. I know the math doesn't work out, but you know what I mean. But I'm not going to sit there and commit to nine minutes. Although I did watch an amazing documentary. Wait, stick on the, stay on the subject, Bill. Um, I actually think that like um, social media and all that stuff, it's starting to make people like mentally ill. And it's creating a new race of people. (laughs) I'm going to call them the Instagrammers. Because, you know, like when you look at a picture on Instagram and you clearly know, you're like, that that photo has been fucked with, right? Like there's like, I don't know, a filter or they elongated the body or like, you know, nip tuck here or there or the person's had plastic surgery. Now I'm actually seeing people, clusters of people, they seem to hang out together like races do. You know, white people over here, black people over there. You know how we are, right? Now you have the Instagrammers and you see them. They, they fucking, <laughs> they're shiny. They have all top label stuff and they don't, they almost, you're looking at them. You know, they're human. Wait, are the robots here? You're looking at them like they, they kind of, they don't look like any people I've ever seen before. Their faces aren't sweaty. They're shiny. And it's like younger people too. So I think they're, they're getting like, uh, I don't know. I think the way the guys are tattooing their face, I think a lot of the women are Botox in their face when they're young. I have no fucking idea. But I'm looking at these people, I'm going like, and I just couldn't put my finger on them. I go, what is going on with, with, with these? Like, I just keep seeing them. They pop up more and more and more. I think the robots are already here or some really... Um, good-looking in a different way, aliens have begun, you know, living amongst us. I don't know what it, I don't know what it is. Everything's like, E. c'est Laurent, bien salaga. Uh, that fucking M store, the store begins with M. You know, what's that one? I don't fucking know. You know, all that designer label shit, and you're just looking at them like, you got like that's like a you got like five grand worth of shit on above your waist. <laughs> like I, I don't you know I don't know, uh, but anyway, and then you got those types of people who are trying to look Kardashian esque, and then you have the people that you can tell you can see it on their face that they argue politics all the time on the internet. They have they they have like the weight of the world on their face, and. Um, and then this bizarre sort of idea that they, that they know how to change things or that everything would be perfect if we all just did what they wanted to do. I'm kind of noticing, you know, as the widget salesman has faded away, getting onto airplanes, the Instagrammers <laughs> and the politicos, whatever they are, they look like... Uh, I don't know. Like, you ever just be having, like, I did, it to, I did it to my buddy today. Like, you know, I watched a podcast and somebody just said something so fucking stupid. I, I, didn't, I, I, I didn't even know what to say about it. It was some, I don't want to get into it because I don't want to, like, start a, a fucking war with, like, another podcast. But it was just, like, essentially... I don't know how to talk around it, but it was just one of those things where it's just like, how could you be so fucking ignorant? Like, you know that thing that people do where they act like history begins the second something bad happens to them and they don't try to see, well, how did we, how did we come up to this point? Like, how the fuck did we get here? You know what I mean? It was like Trump. When Trump fucking got in office, 
And I remember seeing this person on TV going, oh, this was uh, white people wanted to take the country back. They wanted to take the country back with this guy. And it's just like, well, there's way more white people that, you know, that they could have easily just voted against Barack twice and he would have lost. So that's not what it was. It was, I think it was 2008 when the bankers fucked everybody again, yet again, and they got away with it. And then we just had career politicians, Barack Obama, career politician, Hillary Clinton, career politician. And then this guy comes in like fucking, you know, hacksaw Jim Duggan, right? Saying he's going to clean everything up, even though he's part of the fucking problem. That was one of the most amazing things I saw. Oh, the rich guy who doesn't pay taxes is going to help me out. Oh, okay. This should be, oh, I'm going to drain the swamp. I'm fucking neck deep in. So, um, anyway, I don't even know what the fuck I'm going with this shit, but like, uh, like people, they, 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 they act like, you know, I don't know. Why don't I just get off this subject? Because I'm going to end up saying what it is, and I just, I just don't need to create any more fucking drama in my life. 